So I would like to invite uh, two of our very amazing, inspiring uh, movers, facilitator to share some stories. Um, you know um, how they um, how they became how they became from this small potato to this giant potato. So let me invite the first speaker, Anahita, to share her story. Thank you, Linka, for the introduction. Um, so just to give a brief introduction, my name is Anahita and I'm a recent mover from Iran. Uh, so the way I joined the movers program was quite um, irregular because we did not have any other movers in Iran uh, so that I could like get to know the movers program through the local community. But I got to know Dean Long through work and uh, he sort of um, encouraged me to join the movers program. And well, the thing that I want to share about the movers program is a story of when I was sharing the poster of my first uh, workshop, which was with April, I think, uh, which was on um, digital branding and employability. Uh, so. Um, people who were responding to the poster, one of them asked me, what is a mover? And then uh, that second, I, I, I thought for a second and I was like, okay, if I were to pitch the movers program or the concept of a mover, what would I say? Then I came up with this um, concept that I made up but I think that's the philosophy behind it. I'm not showing sure it, but you can like link or Dean Lung can uh, <laughs> verify that. But so uh, from the, the, the perspective of the word mover, the mover word can have two meanings. It's either that when you're a mover, you're a person who is on the move. So you're part of a movement or you're like, in a car and you're moving, so you're a mover. Um, and another meaning could be that you're moving something else. So if you're moving your cup, you're a mover, <laughs> right? So um, so then, then, it, then it came all together that, okay, the movers program is um, a community of movers. And these movers are people who are in a movement and they're sort of moving their own minds by learning new things, by growing. And they're also moving other people. So they're motivating and encouraging other people to become movers. So they're teaching other people and they're helping other people grow and become leaders. So um, in that sense, they have the second meaning of the word mover. So um, that was the that sort of light bulb moment for me about the movers program and um something that i want to share um so when i was in high school i was part of a really good collaborative community where i felt like i really belonged to i felt like um i could really um do anything as a part of that community we could achieve anything and Actually, because now I've been like away from high school for four or five years, I hadn't had that feeling until I joined the movers program. So um, when I joined the movers program, I saw many driven, motivated and strong people in this community who were willing to commit to what they value to their cause and and they were willing to help other people grow so that together the whole community could achieve something big. And I think that's a great um, value of this big community of people. And um, I really want to encourage anyone who um, wants to feel like they belong to a community, who wants to fight for their cause, who wants to empower other people uh, to become leaders um to join this movement and together i believe we can achieve anything oh thank you so much uh, anahita uh, such an amazing uh, sharing and speech uh, you know i really like your 
explanation of movers is not about yourself being part of the movement, but you are also moving and lifting other people up. Um, so yeah, that's I think the true meaning of uh, leadership, right? It's not about just ourselves, but it's also about thinking about other people as well. Thank you so much. Now, uh, may I invite Abdul uh, to share his story? Hello everyone, how are you all? Okay, so actually today um, I'm really feeling nostalgic when I just remember my November edition of onboarding call because when uh, it was my onboarding call in November, I was, I was like feeling worried a bit like I had a fear like what kind of community it would be and I had a lot of questions, right? And uh, before that, uh, I have never been a part of such wonderful community, believe me. And uh, actually, so how did I uh, came to know about Movers Community? That was through LinkedIn. And I use, usually do the workshop on uh, digital branding and employability that's concerned with LinkedIn as well. So there was a post by uh, Unidas founder, uh, Karishma Zakaula. she's also a mover. And uh, I, I just reached out to her and said that I want to join the workshop. And uh, since I was so much um, like interested in the platform of LinkedIn, so I uh, told her that I want to learn about LinkedIn, uh, more about LinkedIn. So I joined the workshop. And that day, uh, Dan Long and uh, uh, Karishma both were uh, uh, facilitating the workshop. So I, I joined the workshop. I attended it. I really enjoyed that. That was really engaging and interactive workshop. And after that, as soon as Din Long sent me the messages, I immediately just registered for becoming a mover, right? And believe me, uh, when the onboarding call happened, just the way as most of the inspiring movers are here today. And after that, I just started my, uh, uh, like I already attended the workshop, but I also did courses on that youth collab uh, website. And I uh, started my, uh, like uh, how to organize your first two workshop, right? And after that, I uh, when I did my first post, when I uh, like I posted my first status in the movers community on Facebook, and believe me, I received a, a very positive and good response. Uh, like the movers community was so supportive that uh, from Den Long Lenka to every mover over there, they like supported me and they they supported me in each and every aspect. Right, that how you have to do it and what are the steps and how to organize your first workshops. So like it's a kind of an enthusiastic uh, movement, uh, like a, a very energetic movement of young volunteers across Asia Pacific. And uh, believe me, you will never regret joining the movers community. Uh, personally, I, uh, I learned a lot of things from the movers community in terms of teamwork, leadership, uh, public speaking and how to collaborate with each other. There is a lot of diversity in the movers community, but we are joined together by a single word that's movers. And that, that makes us a family, right? And uh, like there's a, a lot of diversity, but still you, you love that diversity, right? You get to make a lot of new friends. Like uh, I and Anahita, we did a workshop on digital branding and employability. And today we are here to share our experiences with you. Uh, so, yeah, uh, and uh, in terms of my learning, I was uh, saying that, uh, like, I, you, usually I used to be a bit shy when I used to come in front of the screen, uh, like, virtually I was a bit shy, but Movers community uh, made me feel confident, and now I'm able to do workshops in front of a lot of audience, and yeah, so that's it. You will learn a lot of things, public speaking, leadership, and that's all. And we youth have to support each other. So uh, join the Movers community, and you will never regret being a part of this community. Thank you. Thank you so much, Abdul. Uh, shukriya. I really love your speech as well. It almost makes me feel like crying um, because of so many reasons, you know, like. Um, we're so happy to know that you know that you you joined the onboarding call and then started to take actions and become so um, a very active member of the movers community. And yeah, as Dimon said in the chat, we hope that you know 
few months later, you can come back and say that, you know, today's call is your first call and, you know, you started to uh, be part of the movers community. And then next time it's you're sharing your stories. Uh, and also I want to, another reason that I feel like very, very touching was that I was also thinking about my first interactions with you in the movers one year anniversary and compare with, you know, the last time I was observing your uh, your, your, your facilitations in the workshop, I was so amazed. I was so amazed that your your speaking skills, your confidence um, and everything improved so much. And, and I think, you know, um, it's also because of you taking actions and also because of you trying to intentionally want to improve uh, that you, 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 you made, um, you, you know, your progress of today. So yeah, also congratulations to you for that. Uh, thank you so much, both of um, Abdul and Nahita for sharing.